You know, I'm real thorough with my research, right? So I, I, I watched so many of your interviews. Of course, you know, I pulled from your, your lives and, and uh, I, I went to your YouTube page and watched like all the old videos. What is your relationship with Marley? Marley Mall these days? We good. Me and Marley make money behind the scenes a lot. When they call for Queen Bridge, like the record that the record companies got, we never use that. We don't use that one. Television shows and things like that call for that record. We use one that me and Molly made. We made our own bridge again to where nobody gets no money off of that. Mm, wow. We circumvented that whole thing. And so I used to be the one talking crap about Molly because if I want to get a reaction out of you, I'm going to talk shit because that's the way it's going to make you come and either approach me or you ain't going to approach me. So I'm going to talk shit to get to to what I need to get. If you want to talk about it, son, yeah, I'm saying this about you and, and, and. And so that's my way of, yo, son, what's up? <laughs> but me and Molly have talked about things, and it's like, yo, it was neither one of us. Just like they put things in the way to make everybody look at each other. We're supposed to be a team, but they put things to say, well, Shan, Biz is selling better than you. Well, Shan, Kane is selling better than you. Kane, Biz is selling better than you, right? And they break up the camaraderie. And so everybody thought Molly was jerking everybody. Molly wasn't the one doing that. It's the record company and how it was. And Molly doing what he do. Molly was getting paid as a producer. And if you know anything about producing, that's where the money is. And Molly was getting paid for producing me, paid for producing Shante, paid for producing Kane, until they went on their own and did their own things and whatnot. But that's where he got all his breath from. And that showed me that... If you really want the money in this shank, Water Brothers and Drop Key, you have no way of recouping your record career ever. What are you going to do? I'm going to go find a white boy to do reggae that's from Canada. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. Snow <laughs> was real helpful <laughs> with that. Um, but I'm glad that, you, that Yo. you're talking about this and, and, and saying that you guys were able uh -oh. to nah, talk things through and you. work things out, right? Because Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. I was saying that um, I'm glad that you guys were able to talk things through and, um, you know, work things out because over the years, there's been a, uh, some back and forth going on between you guys and it, it had the, the fans a little confused about what really happened, you know? Um, I know that... You know, he was saying that, oh, you're from Brooklyn. You're not really from Queensbridge. You pulled out the, the birth certificate and said, what does that say right there? You know, he knows. He knows. 